Hey guys, it's Adirun Ke again. Today, I'd like to talk about this simile as white as wool. So to start with, cotton in Yoruba is owu. Owu, cotton. Can you guys see the image here? The fleece of the ram in this drawing book was covered with wool to make it look like the ram's fleece so i thought that was really creative it's something fun that you can do um, in your spare time maybe if you have children with your children so anyway how do we say as white as wool in yoruba we say o is a gender neutral pronoun so it can be e, it can be she, it can be it. I know so far I've never seen anyone as white as wool. A part of their body may be white as white as wool, maybe their teeth or their hair or I think that's about it. O fufun bi egbon wu. O e she or it fufun is white. Fufun. I have a video on Yoruba colors so you can check that video out fufu basically is white b is like b like egbon wu is wool i said owu is cotton egbon wu wool but you can basically just say owu and it can be cotton it can still be wool it can be as a matter of fact it can even be fur so owu is the generic name for anything that is like cotton like that is woolly e she or it is white like wool or you can you know you can say it a different way and say e she or it is as white as wool so if someone asks how white was it it was very white it was white like wool and it, he or she is what the pronoun is. So you can literally be talking about a person or a thing. It was very white. It was white like wool. It was as white as wool. How do you say that in Yoruba? Bawo lo she to. Bawo is like how. Lo is a contraction of two words. Ni o. So o, like I said, is a gender neutral pronoun you could literally be talking about a person or a thing how was it white like for photo to is like up to like what when you compare it to something how white was it how white is it or how white was it either way it still works bawo how lo is a contraction of ni o she you could be saying is it or was it ni o funfuto white has or white up to is how i would roughly transliterate that so how white was it what was it white up to how was it white up to and then i would reply by saying me or them or whoever is replying this time would say oh funfuto is what you would say if you intend to say is she or it is or was very white bo is an adjective for white and it's only specific to anything white so you cannot say oh do do bo it was black bow it was very black no that would not work bow just puts it's like an adjective that just puts emphasis on the color white and it's only reserved for anything that is very white so if it is not white that's a no you can't use it whatever you're describing can be described as bow and 
even if it is white and it is not very white you can't say boo as a description for whatever white thing you're describing you would hear that in like certain certain like incantations and whatnot is like very but like i said only reserved for anything very white however gun is a general word it's a general adjective for very so you can say oh dudu gun was very black oh pupa gun it was very reddish oh 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 gun she laughed very much oh or is she or it laughed very much oh sorry oh, gun she talked very much so gun is like a general but bo oh fun fun bo is reserved specifically for anything that is very white or was very white depending on how you are framing the sentence oh fun fun bo oh fun fun be egg bo oh fun bo is she or it was very white oh fun fun be egg is she or it is or was as white as wool or white like wool so if you have any questions regarding this don't hesitate to ask please like share and subscribe if you haven't done so already thank you so much for your support so far i really appreciate it and i'll see you in the next video have a lovely day and goodbye